Ladies and gentlemen, let's make welcome to the show, Director P. Yeah, did you know? How is it like yeah. working with Ruga? First of all, see Elliot on set. Let's. <laughs> that's what I'm saying, John. Want to know the bad Funny egg? Funny enough, he came before Neptune. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Funny enough, Neptune was still cutting his hair. Bro, I'm going to cast him. He was doing hair. He came and he waited. Like, he was Aww. really cool. Like, he's one of like the calmest and coolest guy I've worked with. Like, he vibed with everyone. It's mm. not like the kind of people that, if you're just working, they just look down mm. like they like everyone on set, like day or day. Mm. So he was really like, we changed the model like three times to the one that he was like, he wanted to work with. So it was like, don't worry, I did it, I did for you. Oh. Let's just get like what we want. Cause they were already given like the energy yeah. and we all could like see it. See, so we're like, see. okay, you know what? Let's just, let's just take our time. We got like another model on set and you know, everything was really, everything vibed well, yeah, from there. Amazing. Wow, amazing. amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Who, you, who you worked with? Yes, yes, I worked on the car okay. so around. Uh, and Star as there. well. No, yeah, I worked with, no, I, I worked at Arista like just a couple of months back. Okay. Yeah, but like my, my first big break was with Clarence. Oh. Hmm. So it wasn't that I taught you most things? No, not like, it, well, yeah. it taught me while we were on the project. Oh, <laughs> oh I see. Now, the idea, I don't know where they go. <laughs> wow, wow, wow. Is there any Clarence hmm. Peters work that you probably see and you just look at it like, ah, this is my guy, no try? Well... <laughs> we always, you know, he's our mentor, so yeah. To me, everything looks good. <laughs> <laughs> you always say, mm. Okay, yeah, no, so, but, like, yeah. mm. so good in what way? The good or the bad? So one thing about, like, I generally, directors generally, I don't, like, I don't bash anyone's work, okay. mm. yeah, because I know, like, the amount of effort, yeah, you try to put into it. And one thing, the crazy thing is, when you come on set, Whatever you planned is always like you might not actually achieve every single thing. Yeah. But yeah. making out a video mm -hmm. from every single thing you were able to like, you know, gather yeah. and it would still make sense. That's like a, another special skill. Mm -hmm. So I, I don't really bash videos. Uh, like I'm not the one to do that. You haven't worked with WizKid, right? Yes. Yeah. You Twice. have. Twice. <laughs> what was the experience like? Did he come late? That's what I wanted to. <laughs> Is he born boy the situation? He came <laughs> at the appropriate time. Who did this <laughs> We'll just give you one, one Senate yeah. seat now That's what because. <laughs> but I want to know who's one artist that you would absolutely love to work with? Um, I don't know. Maybe Rema. Yeah. Rema? Rema. Yeah. Why? I, I, I love. I love his attitude. Yeah. I love. I love his attitude. I love his visual attitude. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And visual. I think I really want to like. I want to dive into that. Tap into the yeah. brain, yeah. All right, uh, Rema, if you are listening, <laughs> Director Pink, they're here for you. Um, mm -hmm. But you talked earlier on, you talked about um, visual um, attitude of artists, and Ashake is one guy that yeah. always has that attitude and the rest. Mm -hmm. But from your own point of view as a director, how do you bring out the attitude from artists? Because I know some people are introverts, some people mm -hmm. are actually lazy, they don't have that energy. How do you do mm -hmm. that? Oh, okay, so... Luckily for me, most of the artists, like literally almost all the artists I've worked with, they've had that energy, that ginger. But I think, how do I bring it out of them? I think it's just natural. I always make them feel welcome. Like, you know, when you, when you come on set with me, I'm already like vibing with you. Like, uh -uh, what's up? Like, I treat you like you're my guy. Like, yeah. you know, don't, we're not this thing. We are, we are guys. So, <laughs> what's up? How fast? So, I'm like, just go run this, blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, okay, okay, okay. Most times they just always just, I don't know, they just like me. It's a cute uh, speech for me, Nalani. Nalani, this is the one Yeah. Like, <laughs> because this was so many. Yeah, like, too many stars. Naramali, Wiz, Skibi. Skibi. <laughs> like, how did you manage? Yeah, I, I nearly lost my mind. <laughs> <laughs> the pressure was like Wessa. The pressure was hot, like it was <laughs> high. It was it was it was crazy. But like I mean, even Rexy wanted to change it for me. What did you do? So like so there was a part where we were we were shooting like um Rex's solo scene. That's mm -hmm. the part with the phone booth and all that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So like it was at that point that Whiskey came and we were expecting Whiskey like like two hours earlier. Oh, so he came late. So he came late. No, <laughs> appropriate time, appropriate time, appropriate time. So immediately, everybody just came to me like this, Bob. You guys, what's up? What's up? We need shoe now. We need shoe now. What's up? What's up? I'm 
supposed to have for Koli in that scene with Rexy, yeah. but I was like, oh, well, for Koli, I say we go scrap no you. Scrap. <laughs> I said we're going to put you for the main scene. And it's like, okay, no, no, uh, so we had to not move every single light that we had. We had to move it to Always. this thing. Then we came back again to that other scene. Chai! <laughs> please, please, just please. That's not uh, our director's. <laughs> how, how, long, how long did it take what? to shoot the, this? Um, okay, we said shooting like um, 6 and we finished by 2 a.m. Oh, wow. So 2 a.m. No, I think, no, 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 4. 4 a.m. 4 a.m. 3 a.m. 3 a.m. 3 minutes video. No, no, that's how. That, that's how. You are doing well. Uh, actually. You are doing well. Actually. <laughs> the video came out to mm -hmm. say that, you know, he shot a video with, with CG. CG Omori. CG Omori. And the video cost about 100, 100 million, uh, million naira. naira. Mm -hmm. It's going to be about the most expensive video here that, that has been shot. Mm -hmm. So, what's it like? What's the budgeting like? Is it really that expensive to shoot a video? <laughs> and, yeah. Because this one wants to start his uh, musical career. Let's know whether we can afford it. Because Portable and uh, TJ Amari for because of billing. Yes, no. <laughs> oh, is it that expensive to shoot a video? <laughs> <laughs> so it, it just depends on what vibe you're looking at. <laughs> I'm, this one. I'm starting to be political, please. Don't worry, your senior seat is waiting for you. <laughs> So, I mean, some people want to, like, you know, do, like, out of the world, do, like, love, you know. But, like, okay, realistically, um, mm. most times for a very neat, like, really clean music video, it starts from, like, 17, 18. 17, yeah. 17,000 naira. Million, 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 mm? million. Wait. Then. 18 million. Okay. Yeah, for something like really, really dope, like we really, no, not anything can be dope or like, but like you know, for you to like dope gets great. For you to have that creative Standard, yeah. control yeah. to do yeah. what you want, yeah. yeah, to a point, yeah, around that. Well, I see reason why some artists not get video. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you so much. For Almost that. it's it. Okay, so yeah. Let's 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 actually just check out. So forget video. about your career, Sha. Yeah. Coming back, we'll finish this yeah. conversation. <laughs> Three questions. You must do it if you are not are you available. Are you available? What do you mean, available? I'm available to work. I'm available to travel, guys. <laughs> I'm available. Yeah, I'm available to shoot. <laughs> Let's move on, though. Let me say a big thank you to Director Pink for coming Ooh. on this show today. I've loved the insights from 10 till around 6, then the politics now started. <laughs> mm. But we absolutely adore you. We're definitely going to have her back because we are feeling this quick, energy. Quick, quick, you have questions? Yeah, what kind of advice oh would you God. give okay. uh, no, so <laughs> <laughs> ladies, that, ladies that want to probably do what it is that you're doing? Uh, okay, so my advice. Um, I always tell them not to just focus on directing alone because we have like other areas that you can actually like specialize in yeah and it's not just about you know following like let's say the crowd in general because i'm i'm just trying to generalize it as like oh okay like directing mm -hmm. and all that but like you can actually go into other places and actually dominate them mm -hmm. that's like the plan that's the idea so if you want to go into directing be ready to shout <laughs> be ready <laughs> be ready to think on the spot because yeah. when everything is going sideways and the rest of your crew they don't have any other thing to impute they just come to you director what do you think mm. and you're like <laughs> like things are <laughs> doing everywhere is burning they just come Are to you ask direct you. and still look pretty no. me no. Uh, no i try at the my my this is my beauty face from <laughs> 7 a.m. I'm looking <laughs> sweet. <laughs> then <laughs> 9, 10. They're not. Maybe they're still setting up lights. I've already started looking. Getting mad. Like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then from like 2 p.m., 4 p.m., I've removed my wig. <laughs> <laughs> so like that, like that, like that. Then when it's not at night, you just ah, street, <laughs> street. <laughs> I probably want my bomb shot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you so much, Director Pink. Yeah.